Well, that's what we're going to try to do here in California. I'm very excited to announce the introduction of AB 1559, which is related to the newborn screening program. With this legislation, we, are plan we plan to add a devastating rare disease called adrenoleukodystrophy to the mandatory newborn screen in California. Now, adrenoleukodystrophy, known as ALD for short, is an X chromosome linked genetic disorder that is passed down from mother to son. The worst form affects young boys, although some girls can be affected as well. But once symptoms show, it progresses quickly and it's usually too late to do anything meaningful to save the child. Correct diagnosis is difficult due to the rarity of the disease and the nature of its early symptoms, which actually may not show up for several years uh, after birth. And these are behavioral, often makes diagnosed as uh, ADHD or low IQ, depression, or even MS in the adult form. And certainly as a pediatrician who takes care of children who have behavioral and learning disorders, certainly know how challenging it can be to diagnose this disease. Our knowledge about and ability to combat this disease has greatly increased in the last couple of decades, including treatments that can cure patients if they're caught early enough. That makes it imperative, medically and morally, that we catch the disease as early as possible, which makes ALD the perfect candidate for newborn screening. The recently developed newborn screening method has a very low false positive rate, and now we have a method to catch the disease and a treatment now that, that will help delay or prevent the disease. So now is the time to add ALD to the mandatory newborn screening program. Big boy, buckled in. I stand before you today for one reason, hope. Unfortunately, there is little that can be done for thousands of young children that are already experiencing the debilitating symptoms of this terrible genetic illness, ALD. But we can do something about future generations of ALD patients if it is detected by newborn screening and as a result, treated before the onset of ALD's devastating symptoms. Uh, Jeremy's actually 14. He was diagnosed when he was 10. As an infant, toddler, and young boy, Jeremy was always normal um, with as, as the other boys in his age group. Every Saturday morning, his job was to mow the grass while I edged and wee whacked. We would often put our car up on jack stands just so he can climb underneath it, smear some grease on our hands, and make sure every, all the fluid levels were correct. This is something Jeremy loved to do every, every single weekend. Um, Jeremy loved sports. At his age at the time, he was tall, he was lean, and he handled any baseball, basketball, football um, as good, if not better, than anybody else. Um, we, he, he loved to wrestle around. Um, at the age of 2009, we started noticing uh, a lot of changes in Jeremy's life. He would, uh, he'd get really confused. Um, you would tell him, son, take out the trash and get your homework out of the car. And he would do something like put the trash inside of the car and then come back in the house and just would, would stare at us and not sure um, what he had just done. Our bill, 1559, does this. Statistically, 40 children in California are born each year with this disease. When implemented, we can start saving affected children from what is essentially a death sentence preceded by an agonizing descent into a vegetative state. We can also save their families from the trauma that comes from watching a loved one struck by this disease. New York and Connecticut are already testing for ALD. And in fact, New York began this January and the first two weeks of testing has already caught a case. That boy now has an opportunity to have a long and normal life that otherwise would have been taken away from him. His family and doctors are armed with the knowledge now that there are options and more importantly, hope. California has been a leader in matters of public health and compassion. So certainly it is appropriate that we join New York and Connecticut to start saving our ALD affected children. Hi, Ethan, look all your friends are here. We can do this and we should do this and we should do this now. Man. <laughs>